Hello, I'm Imogen, I'm from England and I'm the Colonial Living and Sewing Instructor this year at Chimney. What is Colonial Living? Well, here at Chimney we have an original Colonial House which is from 1786 called the Brewster House. So while we're on camp we run a load of activities which would have been done in the colonial times, we dress up in colonial clothing and we just try and give them a flavour of what it would have been like back in colonial times. Campers do things such as we do tin working, we make candles, we play a traditional colonial game such as a game called Graces where you have two sticks and a hoop and you throw it to each other and you have to catch it. Um, we've done things such as quill writing and dressing up in the clothes as well. So the first day, a lot of them will come in and go, oh wow, is this a real house? And things like that, it's great. And they get really into it, so a group that I've had this session, they come in, they want to speak in British accents, and they want to dress up every lesson. So as soon as they get really into it, it's absolutely great and everybody has such a good time. A lot of session, uh, kids in the last session were really shy and timid when we started off. But as soon as we kept going, they just came out of themselves. They had fun with it and that's the point of it. You just, you're able to let loose and be something completely different from everyday life. There's no, we're here at Chimney because there's no um, technology. It's one of our policies. They're able to step away from social media and things like that, but also coming down to Colonial House, you're completely stepping out of our time zone, so they get to have loads of fun with that. Colonial living is completely unique so far as it's so great. You do so many different things every day, and that's what I like to do Like in my life. I like everything to be different. I like to have a go at everything. You don't do the same activity at all any less than you'll do completely opposite ends of the spectrum things, you can do something that's crafty, you can do something that's sporty, you can just dress up and have fun, it's like a mixture of every single part of camp.